Okay, yes, yes, okay. crew. I have just walked up to Joe Carr's car. My man over here, Joe yeah, Carr. Right. <laughs> you seen him out on the bike the other, the other week with us. And uh, we're, uh, we're, we're going to do a little upgrade on his bike today. I've brought a rear spring, uh, a different rear spring, which should make it uh, lighter uh, uh, on the back end and a bit more spongier. Because at the moment it is a little bit hard and it does, does spin, uh, jump around all over. So that's a little bad boy there. That's going to get changed out. The new little one is inside here, which we're about to uh, unwrap. And then we'll show you what it looks like before we put it on. And also, and also today, the second upgrade that we've got is because the one that is the rear uh, brake uh, peg, this is the one that I've got now, which looks like it's in a bit of a bad condition. So I've got myself this nice little beautiful green one. Hopefully, it'll fit on there and it'll look just right. So we've got to change this over, this shock, and we're changing that over today. So this is the new spring, ready to rock and roll. I had a chat with a gentleman that manufactures them, uh, bought off of eBay. Now the upgraded version of this, the one on top of this, is at 350 quid to 400 quid for the organ shock. This is 70 pounds. So if this works, jobs are good. <laughs> So it's a bit of a guessing game. I ain't got a clue what I'm doing. Joe's a builder. Hi, Joe. <laughs> Joe is really, but he's taught himself. <laughs> he's taught himself. He's got the tools. Not as bad as me. I've got a few tools, but I ain't got. I ain't got a bleeding clue what to do. Good engineer, though. Puts his hand to everything. Just put my new gloves on from. Um, Rough of auto jumble today, feel nice and comfy, can't wait to wear them. This is Joe's beast over here. What's this Joe? 250 EXT. I've seen him on it, he's an absolute weapon. Joe looks comfy down there. If we fail bro, we can, we've always got YouTube, we can, we can Google stuff. But he's on it. She's coming. We've had a baby. <laughs> Come on, dog. She's almost out. Oh, yeah. Baby yeah. boy. No. There it is. The standard Fantic XDF 250 shock. Fell in a little tiny bit. Right, so there's a special way of taking the, when these tip come off, there's a skinny side and uh, a fatter side, so we need to know which way it comes off exactly to put it back on. So there is a warning notice to make sure that you do remember that. So it needs a little bit of modification. So we're gonna have a crack at it now. Do the trick perfectly. Right. She's off. There it is. Okay, so you, you brought you took it off in the same the right way, the same way. Yeah, so I can't <laughs> You thought about it then though, didn't you? Did it like that, then, so, Apparently, one end is skinnier than the other. We need to find out with that. So we've got it apart, and now it's the case of putting it back together. We've got bolts everywhere. We've took off bits that we didn't need to take off. <laughs> this is my little mission here. This little green peg, which is uh, been modified. It should go on. We're getting there. So we've gone from standard rear brake to that nice little green one. Yes, I ain't gonna snap off anytime soon. So she's in. Yeah, not much. We've struggled getting her in and out, but she's there. We'll so see how many bolts we have left over. We'll see. 
Yeah. Just come in here. Modification free. Sorting out my side stem. Wobbly as hell. Goes all over the place. Just spiced it up. Hopefully it'll be alright. So we're all good. We are completely finished. We've got no bolts left on the floor. I'm not saying no, it ain't gonna fall off because it might do. We've got a stand, we'll see how cushiony it is. It does look a bit cushiony here. Definitely got better. Yeah, a bit more travel than that. Is it, yeah? Thanks, Lord. Where am I going right here, is it? Joro track right outside his house. Right. Look that. Look that. Not without the gear on. Look that. That way, yeah. So we've just been for a little blast uh, with the new suspension on it so far it's pretty cushy man yeah it feels pretty good we had a little blast up in the woods behind uh, Thingy's house Joe's house um, I didn't do what major because I've got I had no boots on the rope so I was just uh, just just ticking it steady but yeah just feel, so far you know I've got tongue on Wednesday so we'll do a proper test there guys so keep an eye out for that vlog but for today everything's go all good See you next time. If you like the like the vlog, please like, subscribe, um, and we'll see you next time.